Through the Kick and Land project, the Confederation of African Football is showing to students aspiring professional footballers that education is of priority. I kicked my last professional football at the age of 27. I didn't see it coming. And if I didn't have that a bit of background in education, then I would be doomed. And with the education, I can participate as a technical study group for FIFA and for CAF that you can do to combine these two together. And that we have to put it in the new generation's mind that it's very, very important. The Ivorian legend invited by the Confederation supports this notion. C'est sûr que l'éducation et le sport vont ensemble. Nous, nous, on a eu l'opportunité, la, la chance d'être dans, dans, dans un centre de formation. Nous, on faisait, nous, on faisait le, les deux, on a tenu entre le sport, entre le sport et l'éducation. Education is crucial. That's why the Confederation of African Football is now changing the format of the African School Championship. This school championship will make a big revolution. And we change also, I mentioned before, we change the format. Now we will have, the. if you take example of Togo or Senegal or Côte d'Ivoire, they, they organize the domestic competition with different schools in the country. And the winner will be the winner of the, the country. But we, they will select the best players to create Senegal, Senegalese or Togolese or Ivorian national school to play in the level of the zone. You know we have 60 football zones in the continent. And they play among them, the winner go to play to the continent. The president of the Confederation, Patrice Montepi, expresses deep concern regarding the public image of soccer professionals as they conclude their careers. Consequently, is proactively raising awareness to prevent upcoming stars from encountering similar pitfalls.